Let's take a look at how to select multiple layers in Photoshop. So I have one of the thumbnails open from this channel and on the right hand side you can see my layers panel here and there's lots of different layers. Now if I wanted to select multiple, I would do it in two different ways. If the layers are all in a row, so if I wanted to select from this layer, not double click it, but select from this layer all the way down to this layer, what I would do is select the first layer, hold shift and then click on the second layer. That will select everything between those two layers, including the first and last layer that you click. Now, what if I wanted to select multiple layers, but they're not right next to each other? In that case, hold Command or Control if you're on Windows, and you can select the multiple layers that you want to select individually. So you can see these are not all lined up, but every time I click while I'm holding Command or Control, it's selecting each of those layers. So that's two different ways you can select a group of layers or multiple layers. Now I'm, I'm leading into something here. You can actually create groups. I have a tutorial on how to create groups once you have layers selected. But once you have a group of layers, you can actually select all the layers in that group just by having the group itself selected. I have all these layers inside, but if I have this group selected, I actually can affect all of those layers at once, whether I use free transform or I use the move tool or I can even add effects to all these layers by adding an effect to the group itself. So if you're working with a bunch of layers at once and you continually have to select them all, I would put them in a group so you can just select the group that they're in and that allows you to organize things better and work with multiple layers at once a little bit easier here in Photoshop.